$15,000. That's the reward for information leading to DeShayla Harris's killer. The 29-year-old reality TV star was shot and killed during the oceanfront shootings in March. Police say she was an innocent bystander hit by a stray bullet. Sarah Hammond spoke with Harris's mother. She's begging someone to come forward with information so the family can finally gain some closure. It's been five and a half months since the Shayla Harris was killed here at the ocean front, but still police say they don't know who did it. My life is totally in chaos. Um, I don't sleep. I forget to eat. DeShayla's mother, Alicia Harris, says the last few months have been unbearable. I wouldn't wish on my worst enemy. But now the ATF is offering $10,000 in the hopes someone will come forward with information. Crime Solvers, which usually offers $1,000 for tips, has bumped it up to $5,000 at the request of the Virginia Beach Police Department. Someone knows. You know, it's just, they're just not speaking up. On Friday, a spokesperson for the police department says at this time they don't have anything to go on as to who is responsible for killing DeShayla. And Jafari Jones, a spokesperson for the family, says that is unacceptable. For people to be flying here from all over the world and to have no answers, that's to say that if you come here from anywhere across the world, you something happened to you and they would have no answers for five months and some change. How do you have nothing? Harris says it shouldn't take money to get information on who killed her daughter, but she is hopeful the reward will push someone to come forward. Please help me out. Please speak up. Like, you know, just think about if it, if it hit your front door, if it was your family member. She says she's going to do whatever it takes to get justice for her daughter. In Virginia Beach, Sarah Hammond, 13 News Now. If you have any information, call 888 ATF Tips or visit the ATF website. You can also call the crime line at 1 888 Lock You Up. All of this information is on your screen right now and is also on 13newsnow.com on our homepage.